Yeah, um, I'm Toby, you're... Um, it's Verdi, Kieran Verdi. That's the one. I'll take your yeah. badge. You can take whatever you like, mate. All right. Um, right, a couple of questions, first of all. Mm -hmm. um, who printed this off? The bailiff clock. You should say at the bottom who's printed it off. Right, so that, that's what was uh, issued to the uh, property yesterday. Yesterday? Yeah, it was put through yesterday. It wasn't that... put through yesterday at all. That was put through a long time, off, long time ago. Right. Okay. But, but this, January, we, I spoke to the court earlier, and they said you said earlier you put eight o'clock on all of these documents. Yes, we do. Yes. That's right, the time okay. you need to leave the property by. Not but the eviction will take. The eviction will That's take the time place. You need to leave the property by. Yeah. And you can go to the council and be rehoused. If no, you need no. To be. It says there the eviction will take place at eight a.m. But yes. when we spoke to the court, it was ordered booked for 12 o'clock. What yes, document? That's, what? The that we, that's the time yeah, that we will meet the claimant. The time that they need to leave the property is 8 o'clock. What document have you got that you're relying upon to be trespassing on the property as we stand? We're not trespassing on the property, we have a warrant to search the land. Can I can have a look at it, please? Right, so this is the warrant number. So what is the date that warrant was obtained? Because I believe that warrant number is the same warrant number that has already been executed. Um, Two years ago? It wasn't executed two years ago. This warrant, was, Wait, this, this warrant was issued on the 26th of July 2023. Yeah, so that, so there was an attempt... Oh, there wasn't an attempt. There, wasn't, there, was a, there was a discrepancy with the... What's that, mate? That's mine, thank you. Um, there was a, a, an issue, the last time they, the bailiffs attended, there was an issue with the address. It only had 35C on it. The actual order is for the whole whole property, 35, right. and that's why it it wasn't executed last time. So this the, is a, the claimants have had, of, had the possession warrant amended, 35, and that's why we're here. Right. Today. So where is the actual order that grants you authority to take possession? Because that's a warrant. That's just a warrant. Yeah. Yep. The order's at the court. That's. Well, you, 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 well, we don't need to carry, carry the order. To, to we don't prove, need to carry the you, order. You need to prove that you've got authority to be here. There's the warrant. We've that, got the, we've under, possession of the warrant, the possession of the land. We but, have the authority but, to be here. But even in the criminal courts, a warrant, the possession order, we, the eviction we order. Are, we're, we're not criminal court. We're civil court. Yes, I know. There's this, no this seal. Been proven. There is a seal. There's no. Oh, and here, there's, there's no, no seal. It doesn't have to be a seal on there. Yes, it does. On the CPR. No, there doesn't. Well, that's yes, it does. Not have, it's not an eviction order. That's a notice you, of an appointment. You, you need to provide. It does not have to be a seal on that letter. A sealed order, notice of eviction by the court for possession. That would have been sent to. That would have been sent to these premises by the court it doesn't come from us it comes from the court no, itself no because you're enforcing it you have you're, to prove you, you, you no you need to mm. prove you, you need to provide that you need to prove that you've got your authority yes. by the documentation that you're enforcing you need to have that with you uh, can you move off that property please it's yeah, not. Just no, trespassing. you're trespassing. There's vulnerable people in there. No, There's yours. vulnerable That's people the in there. There are vulnerable people. Can you move, please? There are vulnerable people. Do you want us to phone the police on you? You know. You Can you phone the police? What's happened? Yeah. Can you, you know we're phoning happened the police? You know what's There's happened vulnerable later. ladies in there. The police. If you know there are vulnerable ladies. Well. I see a lot I'll of situations like this. I, I used to, you can you move, go, please? This is a, could you phone the police on this man, please? He's trespassing. He's trespassing. You've got vulnerable ladies in there. Are you going to prevent us from entering our property today? You are not allowed to use force. Unless you can provide us with the authority and the order signed. So you are obstructing an officer of the court. You are not allowed to use yeah? for a high no, court. I'm well within my right to ask you to, for you to provide the authority you're relying upon to be trespassing on this property, or what you're relying upon that you believe that you've got your authority to force entry to that property. Well, we can go if, if you want us to go back to the court and get a copy of the order. We're more than happy. On a residential property. On a residential on a residential property, you are not allowed to force entry, high court or county court. Let's not have too many people talking at the same time. There's under CPR 40.4, It states and you've got the CPR on your phone, haven't you? That that's the order has to have a seal 
right. from the court. What that, we will that, do what, is, that warrant. If, if that's if that's what yeah. you're saying, okay, yeah. I'm more than happy to go back yeah. to the court and get a copy of the order and bring it back here. I don't. And show it, and show I it don't to you want. And then this this, this, you are all. I'm, 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 believe it or not, I'm trying to look after both of you because I want to make sure that you don't do anything unlawful or illegal. We are not doing anything unlawful <coughs> or illegal at all. But if this goes into the criminal court, it will get proven beyond reasonable doubt that you never had authority with that documentation. You never had authority to force right. or take the property. That's. I know you're following orders and you're and you've you. Might have done you're this, right, mate. You might have done okay. this before, but this is, just because you've done it before and it's common practice doesn't mean to say it's legal or lawful. I'm because just, I'm people. just making sure that you do your due diligence. I know for a fact, criminally and civilly, that you have to provide and produce the order from the court with the name of the judge that has granted the order, that's given you authority to take the possession or evict. The, the, the okay. of this property. Well, I'm willing really to go back to the court yeah. now and get a copy of that order and bring it back. Can you right. can you also okay. confirm that you're aware that as a High Court enforcement or a County Court bailiff, you are not allowed to force entry to a residential property? That's in the House of Commons. The warrant of possession of land gives the claimant's agent... Where is the claimant's agent? Hang on, Tate. What, what's it, what's it give them? No, but the agent it doesn't the give you right to force entry. For Can you provide the authority that you're here representing the bank, please, by documentation that's been... No, I need the physical... You need to produce the physical documentation that the claimant has authorised you to act for the claimant. And what is the name of the claimant? Because the bank has got them... The Bank of Scotland is a company, it's a corporation, it's a building, so it needs to be the name of the claimant that has authorised you as a name. What's your name, please? Marco. Mark what? Marco. Marco what? Marco Cella. Cella. Marco Cella. And who do you work for? I represent the bank. Yeah, no, who do you work for? Because you're a locksmith, so you work yeah. for a company. What company do you work AMG for? AMG Maintenance. AMG Maintenance, and where are they based? I don't know. What town? Where's your, where's your, where's your office? My office in, in East London. Right, office yeah, but what's the address? Company. Because we, ne I, we need to see proof. Because these guys oh. can't... Hold on a minute. These guys can't full entry to the property until you pr satisfy these two guys that you have been got instruction and been authorised... Are you... The cli hold on, hold on, by, by the, the claimant. claimant. Yeah, so by, the by the claimant. Provable. AMG. No, the claimant has instructed you. The name of the person that's brought the claim, his name instructing you to act on his behalf. Because it's almost like power of attorney. He's given you his instruction for you to act, for him not being here today, it's almost like him giving power of attorney to you to act for the claimant. And unless these two guys are satisfied that you've got valid documentation to prove that you're acting in the, the warrant, capacity. Valid, valid, valid. No, no, no. Are, are, are you legally no, trained? Are you legally trained? Hold on, hold on. Are you? Hold on. I, I used to advise hold government on, on property hold on. fraud and money laundering. Hold, hold, hold on. Let's not divert away from this. Listen, can we keep it on point? These guys have got a job to do, and providing that the warrant, the notes of eviction, is being lawfully executed, execu given to them, authorised by the court, for them to carry out. I'm, I'm they, a lawyer, so I, yeah, I don't know. Yeah, that, I know, Marco, I, Marco, let me explain to you what the process is, because I understand the civil procedure rules and due process. To make, I, I know exactly what box needs to be ticked to get it to where it gets to. And you, if you're acting as an agent for the bank, for the claimant, you need to satisfy these two guys because they can't just come and take the Are you aware of the Criminal Law Act 1967, Section 41, assisting offenders evade arrest and prosecution? What Lloyds Bank is doing is the same. What Lloyds Bank is doing is the same as the Postmasters. We have lots of evidence on Clearway. Are you with them as well? Don't film me, mate. Oh, we're in public. We're on a path, so don't we can do me. that. We can do that. I'm telling you, don't film me. We can do that. I'm telling you, look, back off. It's a public path. Back off. It's a mate. public path. Back off. It's a public path. I'm telling you, back off, mate. It's a public path. I'm not going to touch you. This is a theft. It's criminal. It's criminal. No, you're trying to make me feel fucking small. No, I work. I work. Oh, oh, I work with police officers and crime commissioners. Stuff it with me. I've got your picture anyway. I don't care. Well, I don't really I've care. I've got a picture of you in my. Oh, well, that's here. nice. Oh, well, that's nice don't for you. Don't push me. Don't push me, mate. Are you threatening me? I'm not. I'm not. Are you threatening me? 
I'm just saying, go away. I'm videoing me. Are you involved with this? Are you involved with the fraud? You're right. So it would be very grateful if I could be kept informed as things progress. To be honest with you, so as you're not a party to the case, no, as, no. as these gentlemen aren't either, no. we are, we're no, not obliged I appreciate to... That. Um, we're we're law-abiding citizens. Yeah. Good. Yeah. That's, I'm really Which pleased you are, but you're saying. not a party to, to this. Anyway. Are you, are you aware of the post office frauds? Because this is the same. This is the same. Whenever. This is the same. Yeah, as right. well as I'm others. Absolutely. Okay. Do you understand 2006 Fraud Act? We're going to go back to the court. Yeah. We're going to try and we're going to get a copy of the order and yeah. all that. Okay. If I can just quote a case, which is uh, Regina versus White. Now, this is the one of the prominent cases. To be, to be honest, I'm not interested in yeah. other cases. I'm interested no, no. in this. One. No, all, all it is. What I'm going to do now. What I'm going to do now. We're going to withdraw. We're going to go back to the court. Okay. Yeah. We're going to speak to the claimant as to why we haven't done it now. We will get the documentation and we will provide your friend with yep. the, the correct documentation yep. as you say is required. Yep. Okay, so as far as I'm concerned today, this won't be going ahead today. You've got to understand from her point you, of view. I understand what you're saying. Actually, all the ones I've been to before, because this is a letter from the claimant, from the solicitor, to say it's going to happen at 12 o'clock. Right. Now she's given me the wrong documentation. There's a, there's you another. have the right documentation. Yeah, no, yeah, no. <laughs> You've just spent 15 <laughs> minutes telling me I've got, got the, the right, right documentation and you haven't got the right letter. Let me, let me show you on the phone because it's. No, it's, no, no, I need to no. see, I need to see yeah, a paper yeah, yeah. one. I don't want to see anything <laughs> on the phone, down. I need to see a real document. <laughs> right, let what we're going to do, let, we are going to go. Let me just quickly show you because normally, once, because the claimant's put an application into court and it's been to court and they've got to obtain the possession or whatever, the claimant is duty bound to notify. The parties of the application and the, a, provide a copy of the court order that's been issued by the court, that's been sealed by the court, okay. on what date to send it over. Do you know all they've done? Walker Morris. They've sent. Um, where is it? It's on the third page. You can, you, oh, you, you'll laugh at this. Bank of Scotland, PLC, property in possession. This is on the third page. And they take notice when the company obtains possession. So Walker Morris have sent a two page letter. There's no name, there's no date or nothing. I could type that, you can type that. That yeah. is not satisfactory enough for them to know. That's the always something that she needs to take up with Walker, it, Walker exactly. Morris. Yeah, yeah. That's nothing to I'm do I'm just here to we make sure that what, the, what the claim of solicitors do. Can you tell us who instructed you from Walker Morris? I can't tell you. We're not instructed by Walker Morris, we're instructed by the court. We're just, directly operate, we're directly they employed get a job. by they're the court. They're going in the morning, they get and a we job, get a job and out, we go there, there, there. Can you tell me who, who your line manager at the court is? My line manager is, yeah. is the delivery manager, or is the operations yep. manager, Anne O'Neill. Anne O'Neill. And is she, is she the operations manager for Brentwood? For Brentford County. Brent, Brentford County Court. And who does she answer to? She answers to the, the regional manager. Who, who would that be? Jones. Is it Mrs. Jones or? Right. It, it, listen, I, I'm not here trying to be obstructive in any way. Well, you're, I'm just, you're I'm doing just, a good job of it. I just, <laughs> I just, I just, I just, I just want to make sure that everyone's got the ducks in a row, yeah, like yeah. I say, because there is, a, there is a process, and I've been involved okay. in this several times before, as you can probably yeah. understand. And every single case where, like you say, obstruction enforcement officer yeah, yeah. in the execution of his duty, every single one of them has gone to Crown Court, and every single one has gone to Crown Court, the judge has ordered the bailiffs to produce the warrant, the documentation they relied mm. upon to force entry to the property. Yeah. Mm. And every time they've produced that document that you've showed me, yeah. and the judge said, no, that's not the document. And every single time it's been thrown out, and, well, then, and then, the, then the person's been awarded. I just don't want to, listen, if we can, we can go down that road, but we're talking two or three years down the line, yeah. we're all going to get in court, it's all going to get thrown out, so let's avoid it. Because then it'll be a claim against so that's you and your just, company. That's what I mean. We, we work directly for the Ministry of Justice, yeah. we're not yeah. private guys that yeah, you see on the no, telly no, and all that. We can, can, we, can we also add two other bits? One, you've got proprietary of stopper on this, 
which is a, a, this, this a legal is, standing. Trevor, really Trevor, 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 and, Trevor, and the other thing is, the, the thing is, with this, and the other guys, thing is unless we've got an order from the court, unless we've got an order from the court, say there's a stay of enforcement because of what's his name, an order from the court to put a stay, or there's an abusive process, or like we're discussing now, we need to make sure that all the correct documentation and, sure. and the procedure yeah. being followed. You, you've also got adverse possession it'll have to go, be because it's over 12 day, years. Because, she has like, it. like I say, we're going to postpone yeah. it this morning, yeah. okay? We're going to go back and get the documentation. I'm going to speak to the judge and explain what's happened today. I'm going to speak to the citizens and explain to them. Yeah. Are and are you back later? Hold on, hold on. Oh, we, we will inform the, the occupier when we're coming they've back. Got, they've You're got, not they've, a party to the no, case. Toby, so Toby no, has Trevor, I've got permission to talk. Don't need to. Listen, listen there's no right. rules being changed. They I'll have, they, they can't. They, they, I'm, I'm done with talking yeah. now. Yeah. We're going to go back to the court. I, and I we're know that the, the, all that, the right? things have changed now. Now you have, you can't just say like, no, no. You've got to notify the yeah, and Give them a time yeah. and a date. Yeah, absolutely. She and has got an applica- will... I don't know if you're made aware. She has put an she application. She made an application in. this morning. To She's court. also vulnerable. Right. She made an application to court this morning. Yesterday, the, the clerk or yesterday it was it's put been, in. Yeah, yesterday, it's been listed it was, for a hearing. It was put in before the judge this morning, yeah. and they are because obviously if the judge had listed it this morning, we wouldn't be here. Yeah, that's right. So the judge, well, got back, got yeah, they spoke, they spoke to um, one of the judges in, in the court this morning. Yeah. They said, yeah, he, his instructions were, yes, list it, but the yeah. evictions to go ahead. Exactly, that was, yeah. that I was understand the, that. that. I mean, from our point of view... Uh, off, I don't really want to stand out here in the in pouring line. rain, yeah. getting wet for nothing. See, so from our point of view, your point of view, it doesn't make logical sense, because if her application didn't have any merit, it would have been just been dismissed. But because they've listed the hearing... To set aside yeah. this, it makes sense. But he's obviously he's, he's given the order for it to go ahead. That's why we're. Yeah. We're gonna go back and talk to the judge now. We need yeah. to speak to the thing. Obviously, as we're walking away today, we're gonna give her another set. It's gonna be a minimum of seven days' notice that we're gonna need to give her. We'll explain that to the all, all um, the solicitors and uh, yeah, the bank payment. and all that. Um, but once we once we've got all that um, things in place, then we yeah. will be serving a new notice on her. And and nobody uh, will be back okay. today. No, they can't. It's they going can't. to be seven days they can't. notice. Got, they can't. Yeah. They've got, they have to by law. They've got, they're going, right, listen, he's got a lot of work to do. He's got to go back. Judges are busy. He needs to go before a judge and check that I he's done. All he's done is in a row. All right. So, so we've got to talk we're going to go and do that. Okay. All right. Speak to, speak to them. All the best. All right, mate. Good afternoon. Cheers. See you later. Good job. Good job. Good job. Good job.